top five Tuesday and today's theme is something I'm really excited to do and that is my top five favorite bookish quotes. I love quotes. I think quotes are great to have like I mean pretty much anything you read can be a quote though but it's just stuff that's really inspirational or really just speaks to you and I just I love quotes so much so I can't wait to get into this. Number five on my list is from The Night Circus by Erin Mongenson and it's just the cat phrase or the stuff that brings you into this book which is the circus arrives without warning no announcements preceded it was simply there when yesterday it was not. I just fucking love that so much. It just intrigued me to read this book and even though it's not a complete quote, it's just cool. It is cool. I just love that. I have two bookmarks of that quote sitting on my wall and I love it so much and it's just... It brings back all the memories of reading this book and I definitely want to do a reread soon and I just can't wait for it but it's just it's a great quote and I love it. Number four on my list is from Throne of Glass by Sarah J Mass, and the quote is you could write all the stars if only you dared. <laughs> I hope that's it. Mainly the main quote is you could write all the stars but it is like if only you dared if only you wish it's kind of like you could do anything if only you try like that's just what I love it's like you could rattle the stars you could start a revolution you could start a war you I mean like seriously I just love it so much it's just so empowering it makes me like yeah I can do anything which is so not true but like I just love it so much it's a beautiful beautiful quote. Number three on my list is from Iron Cast by Destiny Soria and it's the quote that's on here we are the music makers and we are the dreamers of dreams like oh my god it's beautiful like can you see how beautiful this quote is I love it so much it's not even from the book though it's from Arthur O'Shaughnessy's ode so it's like a quote that's inspired the book but it's not about the book but it still makes it like for the oh I just love that, that we are the music makers, it's like we can do what, like I love these inspiring quotes where it's like we can do anything if only we dare, <laughs> we can rattle the stars, but seriously it's just like we are the dreamer of dreams and music makers, it's just, it makes me so happy looking at that quote and just seeing it and I'm just like yeah, empowerment is what I feel. <laughs> Number two on my list is for A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J Mass, or really from Akamath this quote is from but just the quote that's to the stars who listen and the dreams that are answered I love it like fairies part I'm looking at my wall here but it's to the people who look at the stars and wish and to the stars who listen and the dreams that are answered yeah it's just oh, I love it so much it's a turning point in the relationship that Fairy and Reese have this quote and it's just done so well but it's just so beautiful just saying the people who look at the stars and wish and I, if you wish for something the stars will answer you and I'm just like it's just beautiful it's just it's a beautiful idea and I love it so much and this is from The Raff and the Door by Renee Ardier and this is my ultimate favourite quote because it just speaks to me on so many levels and I love it and that is my soul sees its equal in you. Like how much better can you say I love someone than the soul sees its equal in you? Like it's just like the I having the idea that you have having a soulmate and someone that will love you completely for who you are in your soul and it's just again another turning point in their relationship and I'm like <sighs> I just, it's my favourite quote ever. This is the quote I say is my favourite whenever I'm asked because it's just beautiful and it just makes me, because I love this book so much, and the quote just makes everything for me and just this whole book is made for me because of this quote. I just, I love quotes, it's so good. So these books have my favourite quotes in them and quite a few of my favourite reads are here, which is very cool, so definitely read these books because there's more quotes in them than the ones that I've just listed off. I just love quotes so much. They're so much fun. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll talk to you later. Bye!